Zero rated and exempt supplies for VAT. Um, what is the difference? In some contexts, if you're the buyer, there's no difference at all for you usually. Um, you don't pay VAT, there's no VAT for you to claim back. Um, but there's a big practical difference for sellers. Um, and the difference is that zero rated um, sales um, are subject to VAT in theory. It's just that the rate of VAT is zero. Um, and uh, exempt sales are not subject to VAT at all. They are exempt and that has big implications uh, for the seller. It's really important that sellers know the difference um, between zero rated and exempt supplies um, because it, for zero rated sales that they make they're able to claim back the VAT that they incur on expenses related to those. Uh, however, where they make exempt supplies um, then they're not able to do so. Um, because the costs that they are incurring are not being used in making supplies that are subject to VAT, whereas with zero rated they are, even though that VAT is actually zero. This can have um, big implications for clients, um, sometimes positive, sometimes negative, but it's always things that they need to be aware of. Um, there's this concept that we call partial exemption um, for VAT and uh, clients need to make sure that they're on top of it. Um, if they're making exempt supplies, they know what VAT they can claim, what VAT they can't claim and there are some quite complicated calculations that can go around that with partial exemption if they make sales that are exempt and at the same time make sales that are also other sales that are also subject to VAT. Um, an example might be um, a house builder um, who builds some houses to sell um, and some houses to retain as an investment and rent out. Uh, the sale will be zero rated, uh, the investment will be um, and the rental income from that will be exempt and that has uh, many complications for what they can do in terms of recovering VAT um, and getting it wrong is not something that you want uh, HMRC to tell you that you've done later. Uh, yeah, and we have covered um, VAT, partial exemption calculations um, and advising clients on what is zero, what's exempt, what they can recover and can't recover um, for a number of different scenarios. Um, so uh, naturally we will be um, happy to help um, anyone that has or thinks they may have um, issues in this area to, um, to give them comfort. Mm -hmm.